to the big Morgan Freeman birthday spectacular, where tonight my first guest is a superstar athlete, one of the most famous athletes in the world. He's Major League Soccer uh, at the Los Angeles Galaxy. Take a look at this. David Beckham, everybody! <laughs> You're so nice and well dressed. Look at you. You're gorgeous with your thing. And <laughs> Thank you're, you very you're, much. You are a bit of a dandy. It's it's very impressive. It's well, good. I'm English. This is how we dress. Well, I've been to England, this and not all of you dress like that. <laughs> Some of these men were wearing tank tops in the club I was in. Well, <laughs> well this is how my mom told me to dress. Well, it's, you look very nice. No, I like it. You're very put together and you smell very nice as Thank well you. for an athlete. Thank you. Is that your own fragrance? Dude? Yes, it is. Is it really? Fragrance, yes. And I have a new one coming out very soon. Hence your appearance on this <laughs> show, <laughs> I would imagine. No, nothing to do with that. Really? What's nothing. your fragrance called then? Instinct. Oh, can I have a sniff? Yes. Right. <laughs> it's nice. It's nice, right? <laughs> You're okay with that, aren't you? You're okay with being uh, smelling Sniff, nice. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I like being. Do you like men coming up and sniffing you? Love it. <laughs> Love it. You're in the right game then, really, <laughs> aren't you? Were you watching? Were you watching the Barcelona Manchester United? Then? Yes. Yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah. That. That. Well, there you go. Unfortunately. Yeah. Well, I'm a huge Manchester United fan, but. Well, you played uh, there long enough. Didn't I played you? there for almost 12 years, so, um, you know, my heart's still there. It was the club that I always wanted to play for, but yeah. uh, you know, they came up against such a great team with Barcelona. So yeah. Was, well, uh, them Spanish can play a bit of football. They know. can. Yeah, they yeah. can. They've got some great players. Yeah. So. Yeah. You were at Real Madrid as well, weren't you? Yeah, I was there for four years. So. Do you enjoy paella? I love it. Yeah, it's nice, isn't I it? Know. I like paella. I yeah. loved. I loved everything about Spain. Yo, admit. Spain's a great place. I like Spain. Yeah, paella was nice. And then, the, what's the name of that wine they drank? Wine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Yeah, I had a nice time. Did you ever go to a bullfight? Um, no. No, you're right. Neither because was I. Because I wasn't sure I agreed with everything. No, I, I don't. I, no, I don't like to see that. <laughs> I went to one once, though. I went to, Bar uh, not Barcelona, uh, Pamplona. Mm -hmm. I went up there and ran with the Bulls. Did you ever do that? No. Because no, I'm not, I'm not actually that quick, so I'd worry I'm stop it. it. You know I'm you're not, not that. I'm, trust me, I'm not. Well, the thing is, as well, you don't want to get your legs near a, a bull running. Not really. No, not that's... Not really. I'm not sure the managers would be... No, that, they wouldn't like that at all. <laughs> when you were at Manchester United, mm -hmm. Alex Ferguson was there. Yes. And uh, my name's Ferguson, but I I'm not related to him. Oh, really? So you, you and I can alike. be friends. You do look alike. Yeah, we do. We're related through being Scottish and hating things. <laughs> Mainly the We're... English. Well, no, I no I'm joking. No, no, I don't, I, I, I don't hate the English. I think Alex Ferguson hates no, the English. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. <laughs> he hates the Spanish right now, but... Uh, <laughs> or some of them. No, he's such a great manager, you know, best manager in soccer, to be honest. And uh, He's pretty you know, good, His yeah. record over the years is incredible and untouchable. Did you ever see footage of him when he was a player? He used to play, I think, for Aberdeen in Scotland and, and um, Rangers. He and always that. said he was a great goal scorer, but yeah, uh, yeah. I'm not so sure. Yeah, he's, he's, <laughs> he was scoring goals before they were goals were being filmed, yeah. so you have to take his word for it. That's true. The, That's uh, very true. Oh, well, look, I can see your tattoo there. Yes. Nice. I know, you've got a few. Oh, I've got a couple, yeah, but you've got, you've got the sleeve, haven't you? you got the full I've sleeve? got two full sleeves. Yeah, really? Which my mum's not too happy about. But, uh, <laughs> Come on, you're David Beckham. We don't have to ask your mum for a tattoo now. Yeah, okay. uh, well, she's still, every time I have a tattoo, she's like, oh, my God, not another one. Really? I'm going to get some more from it, but have you got uh, anything down that low? Yeah, uh, that's as low as I've Yeah, got. see, that's as low as you want to go. Yeah. Don't go further than that. Don't go this far down. It's bad. I saw the great spirit. <laughs> You know that it's going to hurt <laughs> when the rest of the guys in the tattoo parlor well, come really low. Yeah, it's really low. That's what I'm saying. You do smell nice, David. I have to tell you. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> it's very low. I, what did you get your tattoos for? What, 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 what did they uh, um, signify? Every one that I've got on me uh, means something. You How know, many have you everything got? Everything has a meaning. I've got like almost 30, I think. 30 really? 31, yeah. That's a bit too much. I know. <laughs> I know. Have you got any on your business? Um, not yet. I, I was thinking of getting a tattoo on mine. Really? Yeah, let's go together. Okay. 
Sounds great. Let's go together. Uh, you to. wear your cologne, I'll wear my cologne, and we'll, well, I don't have a cologne yet, what but I'm going to get have... We have to think of ideas, though. Well, well, well I'm going to get tattooed, aren't yeah. I? Yeah. Well, what are you getting tattooed on yours? <laughs> well, I... <laughs> I thought uh, what I would get tattooed on mine was, uh, Hi, my name is Craig. Very nice to meet you. Have a nice day. Perfect. I'll think of mine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll, or I'll just get, you know, CF. <laughs> yeah, you, Depending you should on, get that. Yeah, no. I don't know. I think it would hurt a bit too much. Uh, yeah. You really yeah, have yeah, thought about it. Maybe. You really have thought about it, I kind of was thinking about yeah, it. Yeah, really? really? Yeah. No, I don't think I could do it. Maybe on my bum, but not on my, uh, not on my junk. But you never no. know. You never know. What do you mean you never? Well, I, whoever put the tattoo on me, I don't want. His name's Doug. I don't want Doug <laughs> messing around my junk with a a, a, a painful pen. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure I'd want mine messing yeah. around mine either. No, you don't. You don't want to do it. Plus, you know, if he one slip, he could throw you out for a couple of games. <laughs> yeah. Did you have? <laughs> I do like them though. I, you, you have to have an odd number, do you know that, or it's bad luck? I know, I heard that today. Yeah, I just made it up. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I'd never heard it up until this morning. It, it was told to me by a tattoo artist when he knew I had an even number of tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> Would you let your kids get tattoos? You've got boys. Would you let them get it done? Um, at a certain age, I think, if they wanted to. But, what age uh, is your oldest? He's my oldest is 12. We've got an eight year old, six year old, and a little girl on the way in six weeks. So. Yeah. 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 I've heard that before, but chances are you won't look so great when you're 75. That's either, true. So. I'll smell good, though. Yeah, you will smell okay. awesome. I'm yeah. going to smell great. You will. And that's the thing you've got to work out as you get older, because as you get older, apparently, you start smelling like vitamins and wee-wee. <laughs> really? Which is coincidentally the name of my cologne. <laughs> It's going to be vitamins and weaving. Now, do you enjoy uh, living in the United States? Are you having a nice time? I love it. You know, we've lived here for five years now. Yeah, it's, it's a been while, incredible. Everyone's welcomed us in so well. You know, not just obviously around, you know, the soccer side of things. But, right. You know, around us living here. So, you know, the boys love going to school here. My, my wife loves working here. So, yeah. what's not to love about living in LA? Well, there's a lot of. Ay, caramba! Dear Dale. <laughs> One, I don't know if one you, or two. Yeah, or I two. mean, to be fair, the, you know, per square foot, there's more douchebags here than anywhere else, really, <laughs> on planet Earth. I I've, mean, I've met one or two. Yeah, maybe. one or two. But I, do you know what, who I did meet? Who's amazing? I met the president the other day, which no way. I really wanted. He to. was here. Um, no, in London. Oh. In London, oh, I was invited to a dinner with the Queen and the President and the First Lady. And What's that coming? I go. Yeah, and what? Uh, you know, that's the, fantastic. The Look soccer you. player sat with the Queen and the President. It that's great. Incredible. I think that's so, very nice. A man that I really wanted to meet. Did the Queen uh, smoke her pipe when you were there? <laughs> no, but funnily enough, she knew that I was having a baby in six weeks. Oh, my wife's having a baby. Of course. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, she's the Queen. She knows everything. <laughs> she has it, her all-seeing eye. It, sho it shocked Ooh. me that she knew. So. No, but she probably read. Well, I love the magazine. Queen. The Queen's, you know, to us English, it's, and to everyone, I think, in the world, especially. Yeah, Especially right. over here, I think people well, love... Well, they do like it here. Yeah, no, they do Queen that. and the royal family. I wasn't such a big fan of the royal family. And then I watched uh, uh, Prince William get married to Kiki. I know Kiki. what you're going to say. No, no, no. I, okay. what? what, Kiki Wigglesworth? No, go, no, what? go, go. No, no, no. I'm no, I watched it and I thought, they were quite nice. Amazing. They're amazing Yeah, no, people. I thought... I thought Amazing. Like, it made me think, oh, good luck, young people, I thought. Yeah. They, they melted my cold Scottish heart. They you know, did. You know why it was so amazing? Because, you know, Prince William and Prince Harry, we've seen them grow up. Up, you know into real men sure. um, and they've gone through so much in such a short space of time yeah. in such you know their yet their young lives and to see you know Prince William get married and Prince Harry still cracking jokes did you uh, was, did you uh, cry at the wedding when you were there it was emotional I didn't cry cuz I'm did, emotional but I do cry at yeah. things. do you really yeah I'm an emotional man <laughs> at times at <laughs> 
Thank you. At, at times, at that times. That was from lesbian wrong. That, that is the power. Thank you. Man, not only have you melted my cold Scottish heart, that you've melted the cold hearts of the grumpy lesbians of lesbian wrong. David, we're out of time. Would you like a, an awkward pause, a mouth organ, or touch my glittery ball? I'd love to touch your ball. Touch my ball. All right. Um, let's do it awkwardly. Okay. <laughs> awkwardly, okay. David, awkwardly. Okay. Don't go rushing in there. It's not a soccer ball. It's a glittery ball. Okay, okay. It doesn't need to be put in the net just right. yet. Take your time. Am I allowed to touch it now? Yeah, you can touch it now. You sure? One hand or two? <laughs> of David Beckham. <laughs> <laughs> and I say... <laughs> See, <clears throat> there's a popular myth that goes around that, you know, bunny rabbits, whilst cute, have no idea how to cuss. <laughs> Let me assure you that this is an erroneous impression. <laughs> and actually, we do know how to cuss. We're <laughs> awesome at it. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Now, I know what you're going to say. I actually do, I'm psychic. <laughs> you dirty bastards. <laughs> you want me to show you my little bunny rabbit bottom? <laughs> My answer to you is <laughs> no. <laughs> Do you know that it's true though? Bunny rabbits, we have got lovely little fluffy bottoms. <laughs> we do. That's why people often mistake us for Danny DeVita. 